Annie and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to talk about fashion. Specifically what I want to talk about is how I stretch my wardrobe and how I decide to purchase what I purchase to build my wardrobe and how to, like I said, how to stretch it out, how to pull things together. I have very, very casual style. I am not a minimalist, but I, my closet doesn't look like some of them I've seen here on YouTube where it looks like a store. That's not my wardrobe. Okay. I don't, I don't ever want to have a wardrobe like that just because I don't want to sit there for 20 minutes and then not know what to do. So I like to keep mine to a minimum and I will go through things and get rid of, you know what I mean? Like I'll bring something in if something's I'm not wearing, then I pass it along. Okay. So that is what I'm going to share with you today. You're going to see me try some things out, you know, pull things out. You see me wearing different outfits too. And this video today is in collaboration with Lily Silk. They reached out to me again. First time, I think it was almost a year ago that they reached out to me, asked me if I would collaborate with them, and they did again. I believe in their products. I purchased from them myself. So I really do like them. And I'm really thankful that they reached out to me. And it's because of you guys. It's because of you guys, for all of you, for your continued support that I have an opportunity like this. So I thank you so much. Let's start talk a little bit about what I'm wearing here, but you're gonna see it, you're gonna see me with other things on, okay? The top that I'm wearing today is so, and I hate to use this term, but I'm gonna use it. It's very buttery soft. It is very soft. Softer probably than any t-shirt I have, like regular t-shirt. So this is, and again, you're going to see it. You're going to see in the video. And by the way, I need to get a better bra for it, so let's not judge that. Okay. I, I thought I had a t-shirt bra on, like from Victoria's Secret, but I, I can see it. So I don't like that. I'm going to get a smoother one, just so you know. Okay. So this is what the top looks like. I like the sleeve length on it. I love the color of it. This is a kimono that I have. Again, you're going to see this in the video. And what I like about this kimono is that it has all these different colors on it too, so you can wear it with different outfits. So again, love this. It's really comfortable. Silk is, is breathable, and it's really, really comfortable to wear. Really, really love this. Love the color on it. I like these, um, this cut here. I love that. I like to wear dainty necklaces. This I picked up at the Nordstrom sale. So anyways, I just... I look for pieces like this, this silk dress. So this is kind of like a slip dress, okay? Really, really pretty. I love the cut on it. Really pretty color. It's not vibrant or bright at all, which is nice because I do have a lot of vibrant, bright colors. So it's kind of nice to have something that's a little bit muted and toned down. Would be really, really pretty with a pair of heels. I'm wearing it very, very casual though. I don't normally wear heels. But I think it would be really, really nice with heels. I'm also, you're also going to see me slip it on with a jean jacket, which I think just makes it a little bit more casual. I could wear a belt on it, which I don't, I don't really have a cute belt to wear with this one. So I'll have to look for one. But I could wear a cute belt with it. Again, heels with it. I'm wearing flats. Um, my Lily, Lily, my Lily Pulitzer. Um, sandals, which I love. They are so comfortable. I actually picked those up from her sale last year and I love them. I didn't think they would be shoes that would be comfortable, but I wear them a lot. Just can't wear it when it's going to rain because they will be ruined, but really comfortable. But look how pretty this dress is. It's got a little side zip on it there. Um, easy to get on, easy to get off. I'm wearing a size small. Really, really like this dress. I want to say something to you. Please don't worry about Oh, my arms are going to show. Oh, oh, my legs is too short. Mm, don't worry about that. If you want to wear it and it makes you feel good, then wear it. Up until a couple of years ago, I would only wear shorts up to like to my knees or below. Okay. I don't care anymore. I'm wearing what I want to wear and you should too. Don't worry about it. If you feel confident in yourself and you feel good and you should just wear what you want to wear. It's like I'm wearing what I want to wear. I'm just showing you what I wear, okay? Please do that. Don't worry about what other people think. With this outfit, I'm just peering the one bag. I think this bag probably looks the best with it. 
but it would look nice I think with a black bag too I do have a black bag it would look cute with it I have a taupe color bag that I guess I could have brought out too um, but really really love this dress again really super comfortable to wear I'm wearing the same duster again in a top that's very similar to the one that I'm wearing in this video but it's a cream color but again colors like that are you can wear it with so many different things again you can wear white pants have that top and have a white jacket and do something like that and look really chic or you could wear that white and wear a color on top could wear I have a turquoise blazer with it I could wear again this one's really nice because it's got so many other colors in it too so it kind of brings out different colors in and I like wearing um, I like having pieces like this kimono too in my wardrobe as I said jackets um, jean jackets, light jackets, different jackets are nice to wear, different colors that you can pull different outfits together and get totally different looks. Now the jackets that I like to wear that you're going to see me wear in the video, I like to wear these nice linen jackets from Tommy Bahama. They're very lightweight, they're a jacket but they feel like they're more like a shirt but I'm not a big button shirt person I've shared that before unless it's something I'm slip over I'm just not one of those I just they're not comfortable to me but these jackets feel like they're more like a um, they feel like they're more like a shirt same with that jean jacket that I wore uh, with that with the dress that is a Tommy Bahama jacket and it doesn't feel like a typical jean jacket it's very very soft and movable and comfortable and it feels more like a shirt but it looks like a jacket I love it and look how cute look it looks I think it looks really really cute with that dress Again, I look for jackets different color jackets to wear and again depending on the jeans I can wear a pair of jeans and kind of make something a little less you know dressy I can wear if I wear my jeans that are ripped again I'm gonna make it more casual if I wore a pair of jeans that are black or if I wore just a solid pair of jeans and a pair of heels and a jacket and this shirt or that other shirt again or a t-shirt that's in my wardrobe I'm going to change that look and kind of make it like dressy casual and I like to wear like necklaces like this I like this because it's one and done. It's a layered piece. All I have to do is put it on. I like stuff like that. I don't really wear big chunky jewelry. It's not my style, but you totally could do that if that's your thing. Um, I just like, I don't know. I'm just really, really simple with my jewelry. I don't like anything too complicated. I'm wearing gold hoops today. Sometimes because I can wear both silver and gold, and if you can, that's something else to have in your wardrobe. I know we're talking about clothing, but I feel like, jewelry is part of that too because it's an accessory so I think it's nice to have different jewelry and if you're like me you and you can put, wear both silver and gold why not wear it together and mix it up I do I wear I'll wear a silver necklace and gold earrings you know what I mean or vice versa so that's another thing that I added into my wardrobe I have shoes depending on the weather and what I'm going to wear too but I try to look for different different styles too I have some that you're not you're like probably don't see in the video I just bought some mule shoes that totally change an outfit too um, I have really pretty sandals that I wear that are you know different styles some of them have a little bit of a not a like heel it's more of like a platform kind of a sandal I have some of those so I try to look too at when I'm buying shoes I try to think like what can I wear what can I wear what shorts can I wear with jeans can I wear with this dress try to pick different things and try to make sure that I can wear like different outfits you know what what the different outfits I can wear with it so one of the things I really like to do too is kind of mismatch stuff and if you do it the right way I think it really looks cute I'm not wearing a belt in the video but I do I do have a belt that I wear um, I'm really picky about belts I only have one that I really like right now so I'm kind of on the hunt for one but what am I not picking about, right? I know. So I'm wearing the same shirt with a totally different jacket, which I think looks really cute. And I'm just wearing it with shorts. And the shorts are shorter than I would have wore a couple years ago, but I don't care. I like it. And I probably could have worn it with a higher, uh, I, like a platform um, sandal too. 
but I'm just wearing them with my, I think I'm having, I have my Lily Pulitzer sandals on, but just fun. It doesn't match, but so what? I think it looks really, really cute. Again, it's just my style. You probably have your little signature style, but that's how I pull things together. And that jacket, by the way, is a Lily Pulitzer. Really, really love adding those little pieces. Another thing you can do, and I don't wear those here, but some people will wear scarves. You know what I saw somebody do? I don't think this would work. Let's try it, okay? I want to try something on camera with you guys. Because somebody did something today was like, that's genius. She had a leopard color... Um, duster like this okay she called it a duster um and then people call these kimonos she took it like this you know where i'm going with this and then see is this how she did it yeah she did it somehow and she made it into a little and look at now i don't i i don't really wear scarves although it would be nice because then i would hide my <laughs> I might be wearing scarves all the time. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but look at what you can do with something like that and just change an outfit. You know what I mean? I know I'm not wearing this right. She had it a lot cuter than the way I'm doing it. But I'm just saying, see, that's something else you could do. So you could use your little duster thing for something like that. Look at it. Look at it. You know what I mean? So think about that when you are purchasing your clothes. When you're going shopping for new shirts or new pants or whatever you just want to build your wardrobe because i don't just go out and just get a whole bunch of things i just kind of get like little things a little little bit at a time i order most of my stuff too online i like to do that because that way i can get it home try it on try it on with the different things that i have and see you know how it works instead of like when you're in a dressing room you can't really do that you just kind of like wonder if it'll go with this and this is but then when it's when you have it then you're like ah oh, I could do this and I could do that and I could do that with it like this can I can do like just a white jacket that's nice or I could do a darker blue jacket with it yeah that's nice too or I could do something fun like this or again I could do some fun color with it too and just kick it up a notch you know so that is how I pull my wardrobe together those are the things that I look for to build my wardrobe and bags too I'm I I don't want to have like a ton of bags but I don't want every bag to be black okay so I have my blue Gucci I just got the uh, white coach bag I have that really really cute Tory Burch bag you know like even when I'm getting bags I try to think about the different outfits I can wear it with when I'm deciding to buy that like before I get it I just think like what can I wear with that shoes the same what what are the different outfits I can wear with those shoes so I can stretch it out as much as I can I don't ever just get like an outfit like that's just I don't I don't want something that I can just wear once I want something that I can wear with different things create different outfits so that's how I put that's what I do that's how I put my outfits together so I hope that this was helpful to you if you're kind of like not sure like how to pull things together I'm gonna give you a tip too. go on Pinterest okay go on Pinterest and start a board that will that you can kind of add to to get some style like some fashion ideas if I can remember I will put I'll put I'll put mine down there I have a board that I started a while ago I don't go on Pinterest as much I'm gonna be honest but it is a nice place to get ideas if you're someone like I don't know how to pull outfits together I have some boards on there too that are really good visual visually because it kind of helps you like it, it, you know some of them will have like the shoes the sunglasses the scarf uh, the bag the jewelry like everything so it just gives you an idea of um and then some of them there's not you know just people but then some of them you, there's no person in there but it just kind of shows like a whole outfit it just helps kind of you know visualize and give you some ideas of how to pull things together if you're kind of like i'm in a stump i don't know what to wear i'm not sure what to do i feel like since moving here i feel like my styles changed a lot even if you've been watching me for, for a while i feel like you probably have seen that with the colors i wear and everything um but that's really really great because it gives you some idea of how to pull things together so thank you so much again lily 
silk for collaborating with me i really really hope that you guys enjoyed this video i have a discount code below for you guys that you can save 15 percent. i make nothing from it it is not an affiliate but you save 15 percent. so i will leave that for you guys below and again i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and i will catch you guys all in my next video bye oh we're talking about mismatched i had i had a menopausal moment <laughs> so um what are they saying yeah hey it's annie and welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to talk what's my hair going flat i'm gonna try this for number four i think <laughs>